what's happening with y'all it's your boy I'm back again for another video real quick video today so look today i'm gonna show y'all how to quickly uh install the right way load scale i got one i got the kit actually where it came with the fittings and all that but them fittings didn't work for what i got so i'm gonna show you what i did honestly what i did i feel like it's a little bit more simpler so let me show you what i got i ain't gonna hold you long Get All right, y'all. So this is the actual load scale. It took a a 52 millimeter hole saw. This is what got me. As you can see here, like official right way product. You see what I'm talking about? So I'm gonna show you what I did. I took the dash part, and that's how I got it wired in. Um, I haven't tightened everything up yet, but I have, you see, I got Teflon tape on it or whatnot, and it's got like a fitting in there to where it won't get loose. And what I did was I just tightened this up and I ran it out and then I ran it down and out. If you can see it on that corner right there, I just got it roughly ran down the passenger side beside the frame rail all the way back to the airbag. And I'm gonna tie into the airbag, excuse me, with this right here. Uh, there's really no part number for this. I went to Fleet Pride and the lady put it together for me. It's uh, three eighths, three eighths, and then I wanna say quarter inch for this black airline. And all I'm gonna do is split the airline down the middle, connect one end, connect one end, tee off for the gauge. There you let me show you. As you can see, I got my quarter inch line. Like I told y'all, I, I had it roughly ran through the frame. See what I'm saying? You can catch it down there. But what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, let me see which one I want. I want to tap into this top one. Let me follow here. Be this line right here. I mean, a quarter inch. I got that brass fit and I'm gonna put on it. And then we'll air it up, see if we got leaks. See what I'm saying? The whole way down the frame and make sure that the line didn't rub on nothing. 